Hello my dear friends, welcome back to the channel and today's tutorial we are going to create like this 3D phone rotation animation in the After Effects and this is going to be a really interesting tutorial so make sure watch till the end also if you are new to the channel please don't forget to subscribe so let's go to the After Effects first of all create a new composition and name it main and make the size 90 20 by 1080 and go to the 3d render and select this advanced 3d and hit ok i'm using this iphone glb file you can download from the description if you want and hit ok press s and decrease the scale size and i'm going to make it 34 and move it in this center press r and change the y rotation so let's rotate it 180 degree after that right click pre-compose it and name it phone and hit ok and click on it to make this layer 3d and enable this star continuously rasterize now double click onto it and import this screen and press s decrease the scale size now right click pre-compose it and name it display and hit ok make this layer 3d and double click on it now place your phone screen and press s increase the scale size so let's fit the screen and move this under the display layer and mask it with this display all right now this is the our display we have to move this out of this phone so go to the top view and select the display and move it front of the phone all right now go back to the active camera and press s decrease the scale size fit the display on the phone screen let's make it 31.6 i guess and this is looking good and make parent to the phone 3d glb file and go back to the main composition and if you rotate this phone then you will see phone and display both are rotating together now we have to make a multiple duplicate copies of this so control to duplicate change the front layer color so let's make it yellow and disable the layer for now and select this phone layer press s and decrease the scale size so let's make it 64 and go to the top view and move this phone back side and enable this proportional grid and select this pen behind tool and move this anchor point in the center all right so now we have to make multiple copies of this and control to duplicate press r and rotate the y rotation so let's rotate the 14.5 and again control to duplicate press r add the plus 14.5 again control to duplicate press r add plus 14.5 we have to do this multiple times duplicate the phone layer and rotate it 14.5 degree All right, so you have to create like this rotation of the phone. Now right click new add the null object and name it Y rotation. And move this under the main phone yellow layer and select all phone layers and make parent to this Y rotation layer and make this Y rotation layer 3D. Now right click new add the camera and select this 35 mm camera and hit OK. And right click new add the null object name it camera controller and make this camera controller 3d and select the camera and parent to this camera controller now select the camera and move it under the phone circle and this is under the phone circle now now go back to the active camera and disable this proportional grid so select the main phone layer press r select this y rotation and hold alt click on it to add the expression and type time asterisk 50 let's rotation it to right side so i'm going to make it minus 50. now we will add y rotation so go to the one seconds add the x rotation keyframe and go around four seconds and you can rotate like this and go to the six seconds and again rotate something like this after that right click new add the null object and name it z rotation 
and move it above the Y rotation and select the Y rotation and make parent to this Z rotation and make this Z rotation 3D as well. And after that, select the Y rotation null object, press R. We have to rotate this Y rotation null object. So hold Alt, click on it to add the expression and type time asterisk 50. It's really fast. So let's make it time asterisk 20. And select this Z rotation, press R. Add the Z rotation in the beginning, go to the 4 seconds and rotate like this. And go to the around 8 seconds. Rotate like this, okay? And go to the around 11 seconds and rotate like this. Now make the render area 11 seconds and select the yellow layer phone and press S decrease the scale size of base. Now right click new add the adjustment layer and move it under the Y rotation null object and go to the effect in preset panel and search Gaussian blur and apply onto the adjustment layer and increase the blurriness value. After that right click new add the light and select this environment light and make sure car shadow should be checked and hit ok and press R change the Y rotation and X rotation as you need. So this animation is completed. I hope you like this tutorial and if you like it then hit the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. You can download the all file from the description. So meet you in the next video till then take care and bye bye.